So Joey Dance, what's it like coming into a hostile environment like this? You've been here before, were you ready to compete here? How do you get your guys ready to compete in this environment? Um, I mean, this is something we love to do, man. Even though we have the fans rooting against us, I, I love this environment. It might not be rooting for me, but I mean, when you hear them screaming, it, it really just gets you going. Now you and you and Peters kind of have quite a little. I don't know if it's a rivalry. Why well, you've wrestled quite a bit. You kind of been having some crazy matches back and forth. Uh, what are your expect expectations going into that match? Um, I mean, I just want to keep on building. I, right now, I think I've I've won the past like four matches. But I mean, he's still a great opponent, man. He knows how he knows how to get those big points. So I had to be careful with that cow catcher he has. He's a uh, he's a real solid wrestler, and so I mean, I just had to kind of stay focused and uh, kind of build on what I've been doing. And what were you guys thinking as a team coming in here? You know, this is a, a rowdy crowd, big yeah. dual meet. How do you guys stay calm in that kind of environment? I mean, even at 74, that was a crazy match between Epperly and Lujan, yeah. but it seemed like Epperly's face, it was just composed. It was like nothing kind of overwhelmed him. Yeah, I mean, that's something we definitely stress a lot, is just kind of staying composed and don't let uh, an environment like this scare you. This is something we're excited for, and so I mean, if we're going to an environment like this, you got to really kind of just push the pace the whole time, the points will come, and then the fans will quiet down a little bit. What'd you change this off season? What'd you do differently? What'd you focus on? Do you think to kind of lead you into this season? Oh uh, well, I feel like I rested my body a little bit more. I kind of got dinged up at nationals a little bit last year. I rested my body, and that way I would feel good coming into this season. But I mean, obviously we got a great team this year. We have a few young guys that are kind of in the lineup. We have a 33 pounder and a 65, but uh, they're learning. They're going to get better. They're going to be there at the end. And then kind of just go through what happened at the end of the match. You kind of saw Peters maybe dinged his knee again, and you just—I mean. That is great sportsmanship. You just grabbed him, kind of helped him up. What's going through your mind there? Um, I mean, obviously I want to get a major for my team, and really, I mean, that's really what I should have done, but I mean, I don't know. When I just see a competitor like that that I really just kind of respect a lot, I mean, uh, you really can't do anything but you just try to help him out. getting the four point boot there early on. How big was that for you? Kind of talking through that. Um, I mean, starting, the, starting the match off big is definitely uh, something you stress a lot too. I mean, if you get you get up four to one right in that first period, it's, it'll help you out throughout the match. So I mean, that's something you got to keep on building on. Something you stress in the room a lot is scoring points early and really getting after the guy. That kind of quieted the crowd right off the bat too. Yeah. How yeah, big yeah. was that for your team? Um, I mean. I wouldn't say it was so much for the team rather than me just because I was the one wrestling out there, but I mean, it just shows that I mean, once you put points up, it kind of quiets the crowd and gets the whole team a little bit more calm and that we can carry on with our, with our win. Were you expecting him to wrestle tonight? Um, I mean, yeah, of course. I mean, even though even though he, he had his surgery and stuff like that, you always expect guys like that to wrestle, that they're competitors, so, and so I mean, it's something you really look forward to. I was, I was excited that he actually came out and wrestled me tonight. What was your assessment of, of your performance? Um, I mean, yeah, I won the match. I won eight to three, but I mean, at the same time, I really need to pick up that major. I probably could have done it near the end, but uh, it's just something I need to do. Just kind of keep on scoring points the whole time. You got Missouri coming up. What are your What are you kind of thinking? Do you Are you right away focusing on the next one? Or are you kind of letting this one settle in a little? Or what's your focus going into that duel? Uh, I feel like we're definitely on to the next match. I mean, we're uh, we have an off day tomorrow. We're traveling tomorrow morning, so we'll get a workout in. I think here at U and I tomorrow morning, and then we'll go ahead and hit the road. So yeah, we'll we'll be, we'll be ready, and I'm definitely focused on my next match. Awesome. Thanks. What was it like from a viewer standpoint watching 174? Oh God! It was um, it was it was a little crazy. I mean, Ev has those matches sometimes where where it gets close and it really gets me out of my seat. I mean, I, I feel like the whole team has it the same way. I mean, they're they're excited to, they're exciting to watch. Even when the fans are kind of rooting for their own guy, it kind of really gets you into it a little bit more. So I mean, it was fun. I, I, I like watching matches like that. What's the difference in your team now versus a year ago? After you guys have attained that trophy, have things changed? Is there a different mentality now? Um, really, I feel like it's just kind of getting the confidence. It's back in the team. I mean, I feel like when I when I when I was uh, thinking about coming to Tech, I feel like the whole team uh, was kind of thinking, oh well, we might get in the top 20, we might get in the top 10. But now we're thinking national title, and so I mean, really getting fourth in the country last year was good and all, but we're looking for something bigger. Thanks,